We're having a blast here at Wonderama. It's been a fantastic show with amazing guests. And my next guest is just as amazing. Say hello to Mike Pollock. Hello, Mike. How you doing, buddy? Very well. Now, he has a cool job, an amazing job with amazing talents. And I want you guys to guess what he does for a living. So, Mike, uh, what kind of hobbies do you have? Well, I've got two kids, and they usually take up most of my time. And then when I'm not watching the kids, I listen to a radio a lot, because I like to hear people's voices, kind of study the voices on I talk you, radio. Mike. Okay, so this job, have you been doing it most of your life? Well, actually, I've been doing it in bits and pieces, different various fields that have been associated with what I do. But I've been doing it professionally since college. What gives you inspiration for your job? I've always liked to perform. I'm a born performer. <laughs> so always I'm on the stage or I'm performing for people anywhere. So I just love to show what I can do. What do you think this guy does for a living? Just yell it out. <laughs> He's a voice actor. Did they get it right? They absolutely did! Oh, man, Mike Pollock, a professional voice actor. Thanks so much. Unbelievable. And where are you from, Mike? I'm from Long Island originally. I had to give up this voice. Can you do a Long Island accent? Oh, I can. It's really a very fun voice to do. <laughs> no, you do that too well. No, I know you're doing some cool stuff, cool characters. Like who? Well, anyone play Sonic the Hedgehog, the video game? Sonic the you like? Of course, man. Do you know this guy? I'm Dr. Eggman! You are the real Dr. Eggman? I am. I have been for the past 13 years. No way. Do you guys know Dr. Eggman? Yeah! He's right here on our stage. That's crazy. So can you give us a little bit of Dr. Eggman? Or... It's all about being evil. <laughs> I hate that hedgehog! Whoa, isn't that cool? Man, and these characters, like, you come up with some of them yourself? It's a real interactive process. The director will usually show me a picture of, say, this guy, and they'll say, well, he's kind of angry and evil, so we want sort of an angry, evil voice. Or maybe it's some sort of little light character that wants this type of voice. So it's a real back and forth. And you have a saying, lot of voices in your head always oh, going yeah. at the same time. Oh, it's really annoying. Like I said, he's going to do a voiceover recording simulation. Explain what's going to happen here, because this is awesome. Sure. There are two ways to record. There's prelay, where we record the voices, then they animate. Okay. And then there's dubbing, where usually stuff comes in from a foreign country in a foreign language, and we've got to watch it and match the lip flap as we record. Usually it doesn't happen in real time like this. Usually we go line by line so they can make every line fit just right. But I thought it might be fun to see if I could do it in real time. You want to see Mike try and do this challenge? So yeah! We're excited, man. Here we go. Keep up, you two. I need to know whether my latest invention, rocket skiing, will become a new fad. I'll be rich! Ah, oh, I think I dropped my trainer in the water. It's here. It flew into my face. Grab it, quick. Ouch! Ah. What are you two resting for? We still have tests to do. Ah. Don't worry, Larry. At least you found my retainer. I'm waiting. Yeah. That's crazy. Mike Pollock, everybody. Hey, that so is much. not easy, dude. That is tough. I didn't know I could Excellent. do it. Excellent. That is a fantastic. Thank you for Thank sharing you. your amazing talent with us. Appreciate it. One more hand for Mike Pollock.